Stanley Johnson, the Remainer father of Boris Johnson, once addressed his family's feud over Brexit in an unearthed interview. Stanley Johnson, 81, raised eyebrows last week after he said Brexit was probably a good idea, due to the EU's lackluster response to Russia's invasion of Ukraine. The former MEP's comments marked an extraordinary U-turn from his pro-Remain position before the 2016 EU referendum, which had put him on a collision course with his son. Prime Minister Boris Johnson, who fronted the Leave campaign despite previously voicing pro-EU sentiments. The Johnson family remains bitterly divided over Britain's place in the 27-nation bloc, with Stanley's daughter, Rachel Johnson, and younger son, Joe Johnson, firmly against Brexit. Stanley has even addressed the family's internal feuds over Europe. A reporter for BBC Points West once asked him, what happens at Christmas lunch? Stanley, speaking in 2019, replied, Well, Christmas lunch, you eat the turkey. You have to decide, there's some pretty key decisions to be made. I mean, you've got some remainers on one side and leavers on the other. My line is to say, okay chaps, what is it going to be? Is it going to be breast or is it going to be thigh? The journalist then briefly laughed at Stanley before appearing perplexed, and then asked, yeah, and what does Boris say? Does Boris say the same? Does Boris say breast or thigh? Stanley then adds, when I say breast or thigh I'm talking about the turkey, let me be clear. Okay folks. At the time of the interview, Stanley's son, Boris Johnson had been dealt a major blow as his younger brother Joe Johnson resigned from his cabinet and as an MP. The then business minister quit over the government's Brexit plan and cited unresolvable tension in his position. The Prime Minister's sister Rachel also piled pressure on him when she joined the Liberal Democrats in 2017 in protest at the government's plans for a hard Brexit, which she claimed would end the free movement of people. The journalist and author used her mail on Sunday column to deliver a startling rebuke of her brother, then Foreign Secretary. She wrote, growth is slowing, with GDP predicted by the CBI to be down 5% by 2020, and on it goes, and Brexit hasn't even happened yet.